This is the 12 in one multi tool and the nine in one function hammer set. You're getting it beautifully gift box. It comes in its own box. Craig, one of the things you and I were talking about was how these 21 tools the way they feel. It's not your normal multi-tool feel. These are strong. Yeah. They're not wimpy. And that's the, the first thing that you notice, Rose, yeah. when you get this home and you put it in your hand, you really feel like that's got some good weight to it. Yeah, and you know, I use all different types of tools. My truck's full of so many tools. But I know the difference about a good tool when you put it in your hand. But I want to show you because this is really what you're getting. Okay, oh I'm going to put this one down and I'm going to keep this one up. Take a look at this. You're getting a hammer. You're getting two sets of pliers. You have a square a curved concave so you can get into all those coach bolts around the home. You've got wire cutters and this is a great feature and glass breaker. Oh, wow. I mean, so if you're ever in a pickle, this can work as a safety tool. Wow. Now, as you come down, take a look at this. You've got a knife and I always like to say, mate, that's not a knife. <laughs> but take a look at that. You've got a knife, you've got a saw, you've got a file, you've got a flathead screwdriver <laughs> and you've got this really thin, which I think is absolutely fantastic, screwdriver bit because you can get into all those tight spots. And when you're done with it, guess what? It pushes straight in, locks away into that safety handle right. that you've got here, right. and then you've got the grip. But like you said, you're getting the two back. Right. <laughs> right. right. So you've got another saw, you've got another bottle opener, you've got a wire cutter, you've got needle nose pliers, you've got a Phillips head screw, you've got everything. You've got 21 Attachments. Take a look at this. You've got your three eighths, you've got your half, and then you're going all the way up to a three quarter inch. Now, that's just a construction term, but I tell you right now, most of these bolts are three quarters to seven eighths. You want it to be able to do that. Right. That's what I know as, as a guy in the trades. Okay, can it do that? Can it do this? Can it do this? Okay. So I'm going to switch it out because now I've got the screwdriver. So you can get some of those really fine screwdrivers as well, because remember, you have that. And once you get this home, you really start to think about the things around home. This works, this might work a little bit different for you, but this works perfect for me because it's narrow, gets into Benny and Weston's little toys. I was gonna say, and toys. the length of it, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. so I can change out those batteries, which cost me a fortune. Oh, please, who are you telling? But with, with, with that, and then you've got the flathead flat as yep. well. So you have all the different stuff that you want. These are some of the older screws. You find them on some of the letter boxes, the mailbox, um, right. some of your signage. These are all your cabinet screws going all the way along, but are strong enough to get the box. Maybe if you are building with your kid or your daughter, you yeah. know, uh, maybe this is the tool set you want to give them for the first time they start building so that they get to know tools. They feel comfortable with tools. They're not as overwhelming and yep. kind of intimidating as your bigger tools. And, and once again, if you picnic, if you camp, if you RV, if you're on the boat all the time. Isn't this a dream?